my gosh, repacking everything because my bag was overweight, like one and a half kilo. Good morning, it is 11.16. My flight is boarding at 11.55 and if it wasn't for Stefan, I wouldn't be on this train. Oh my gosh, repacking everything because my bag was overweight, like one and a half kilo. Praise the Lord for no lines at security control. All right, so this phrase is only reserved for very high stress situations in which I am an extreme idiot. Me got me Jesus. Like the sweat is dripping off my back. I am so freaking lucky that there was no line in uh, at security check and passport control. It is now 11:45. My flight is boarding in 10 minutes. Honey, Charlotte, I'm so sorry for the stress I put you through. Like this is not fun. This is not fun for me either. It sucks. It sucks being late all the time. I got a chai latte. I bought a sleeping mask. Seriously, if you travel a lot, invest in a good sleeping mask because they make a world of difference. I also invested in a sleeping pillow from Express Pal. Love it so much. It was like 14 euros, which is ridiculous for a sleeping pillow, but it's so good. There we go, gate G5. And the gate is open. We are flying with Tui today. And we are going to Curacao, winning in life. And there's our plane. Oh, by the way, this is a sleeping mask. Let me just demonstrate. Look, look. It's really good because it, you know, I can't see any light and it's so soft and nice. Also, you probably did not know, I'm a little bit papiamento. Conta by douchey. Oh no, no, you have to do it with the Antillian accent. It's like douchey, douchey, conta by douchey. <laughs> I'm for sure going to practice this whole week because I love papiamento. It's such a fun language. I was actually supposed to board earlier because they're boarding according to seating and now they're at like, I think seats 50 or something and I didn't check my boarding card. Apparently I'm seat number eight, so. I was supposed to go board way earlier, but you know, you have Wi-Fi, Schiphol and everything. I don't want to sit in a plane if I don't have to. Yeah, yeah. thank you well. <laughs> and then you wait in line again. So we've got seat 8C. Hi, hi. What's your room? 8C. 8C? Yeah. Okay, thank you well. Comfort, baby. Look at all this leg space. Look at all this leg space. So I got extra leg space and I'm nearby the toilet. Waiting in line. We are first flying eight hours to St. Martha and then we have a half hour stopover and then we're going to Curacao. Ooh, what did I do? What did I do? Oh no, I have to listen to the nice lady. Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gobi van die Boga and I'm your person on this flight. The insisted person is Joyce van a vegetarian risotto with mushrooms and a roll over here some real butter over her and you have to see the dessert I already peeped a little bit so this is a puff pastry a brownie and a tombo so Dutch we are now eight hours into the flight and only one more hour to go until St. Martin it's actually very relaxed perhaps because we are just lying during the day and I'm just chilling and this book you have to fill in an immigration form, and that's what I'm gonna do right now. Welcome in Dushi! Oh no, no, no! Bombini in Dushi Curacao! <laughs> and it's warm! All the warm! Did my lens fog up? No, no, but it's it's Caribbean warm. This is also very different than Brazil warm. It's Caribbean warm. It's very humid. I love it! Big pink is in the house. I got the voucher from Sunny Cars. Yes, it got all messed up in my bag, but let's pick up the car. Car rental straight ahead. While I'm waiting, we can talk because uh, even though I'm picking up the car at Avis, I arranged the car with Sunny Cars, who usually does business with tour operators, but you can also book through them directly. And they have this wonderful new thing if you watch yesterday's vlog, it's called the No Deposit arrangement where you just fill in a form with of course your driving license details and your uh, passport details and then you arrive and you just pick up your car with the voucher so that's awesome i put uh, i put their link down in the description below if you're interested and uh yeah let's drive around in curacao yeah perkovic yeah 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 oh, uh, heeft u de voucher nodig? Ja, de voucher en ja. rijden. Oké. Okay. Hier moet u uw huisadres noteren. Oké. Okay. En mijn rijders. Oké. Okay. Ja? Niet naar uh, 
niet mag maken. Dus dat Deze? Ik mee gaan zwemmen. Ja. Oké, okay, so we should not swim with this one. <laughs> this is going to be our wonderful car. This lovely lady is showing me around and telling me how to use it. And she was just showing me the spare tire. And I was just, nah, I need a telephone number. I don't, I, I'm not good at that. Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh yeah. We have to check what's on the car. Like scratches and stuff like that. Hello, welcome to our new ride. So this all went smooth. The lady was so freaking sweet. She like, checked everything in the car with me. She gave me instructions. She helped me with the luggage and everything. She told me how to get to the hotel and we just had such a wonderful chat. So I feel very welcome in Curaçao. Also, I just realized this is like the first time I'm traveling solo ever since I came back from India. So that's been six months and I'm just... Somebody behind me? No. And I'm just, I'm a little bit nervous. I have to, you know, I have to admit that. But this was wonderful, like this whole process with um, with no deposit, with sunny cars and the lovely lady. So I feel a little bit more at ease, you know, when you're afraid, you just need distraction and lovely people around you. And then we're just gonna do it. I have no uh, navigation system. So I'm going to try to do this because the island is not that big. Uh, there's a lot to do, but it's not that big in terms of distances. I'm just going to try to use Google Maps and I've preloaded it uh, with the airport Wi-Fi. They have airport Wi-Fi, awesome. So let's just see if I can do this. <laughs> Lego. Oh, by the way, the car is automatic. I'm so freaking happy Stefan now has an automatic and I've had plenty of time to get used to it. Let me turn down the radio. Dude, dude, we made it, we made it. <laughs> I was so afraid. One thing I already found out, like signaling is, is not really a thing here, you know, which way you're going, it's not important. Luckily, I'm used to Mumbai traffic and the crazy Yugoslavia mountain traffic. So yeah, thank you dad for learning me how to drive in everywhere, basically. And also I had the most magnificent view going over the bridge and it was like such a roller coaster experience. I have to be very honest, I was I was quite afraid, but you know what I I'll just give you a little um advice on when you're really afraid and no one can hear you talk. I just talk out loud to myself, like, yeah, Ivana, you can do this, come on, oh you're doing so good, girl, blah 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 blah. I used to do this all the time when I was on the on the scooter in uh, in Bali and I, I just did it as well because <laughs> It was just, you know, it's dark outside and it's a new country and it's a new car. It's just too much news um, piled on each other. I know for sure that when I'm here for like one or two days, I'll be completely fine. But this was, you know, um, it, it was it was exciting <laughs> and I'm very happy we made it. Just checking in and this is where we're going to be staying, the Avila Beach Hotel. So I am checked in and I have all the breakfast vouchers here, but... Wait, I have to surprise you in a room. Three, two, one. <laughs> Look at this. A full bone kitchen. Massive bed. Massive sitting area. This is incredible. And over here I have a working area, which is also awesome. <gasps> Stop. Yes, yes, I want to film my pampering routine here and I'm still gonna do it and hello We're in Curacao, baby. Oh This is so pretty. Look at that. Look at that all the angles for selfies I bet this is really good selfie light too. Oh, you see that my curls even shine after 10 hours of flying and there's a shower over here Oh my freaking gosh, this is so pretty I am going to take a shower first and then we're heading to the... Wait, I didn't even see this. Rituals, yes! Oh, I love that brand. Oh, we're for sure taking a bath here. So uh, I'm gonna take a shower first and then head down to Bel Terras for the dinner because we're having dinner over there. If you're excited, put a thumbs up. I am so fresh and so clean, clean. And I just put on a decent outfit. So these sandals are from Zara. The pants are also from Zara. This body is from, you can see the back over her, is from ASOS. And the bra thingy, like the cross thingy, is from H&M. 
I actually already made this messy, which is not good because this is awesome for back pictures and stuff like that. All right, let's have dinner. Oh snap, how can I forget to show you this? I got my Chanel out again, <laughs> yay. Rook. There's a bar here. Oh, we're going to check out this tomorrow, the beach. But I think this is the restaurant. Yeah, it is. Yes, it is. There we go, Belteras. I've got some yuca chips over here with a pineapple dip, which is also a little bit spicy, so I'll try it. I think it's like cassava. Mm, really good. We also got a little appetizer. So this is a vegetarian quiche with truffle mayo. And over here, oh, let me feel. This is, oh my gosh, I wish, I wish honestly that I could put this through the screen to let you feel it. It's, the bread is so crispy and it's still warm. Oh, holy snap. Look at this artwork of a risotto. I already saw in Mushi's vlogs, like, this is the best place to have, like, clean food and... Oh, it looks so good. For dessert, I ordered the Ava Limunchi. I can't, I can't. How Pinterest perfect does this look? It's like beet egg whites with a lemon flavor. Mm. The ice is at the bottom and there's also a basil flavor. Wow. Even if you're not staying in the Villa Beach Resort, I would highly recommend you to at least have one dinner here if you're um, with your lover because it's, it's very romantic and the food is so good. Oh my gosh, we didn't even do a bed test. Let's do this. Three, two, one. Woo! It's a medium bed. It's not that soft, but it's medium and it's fine. And I'm so going to enjoy my sleep. Right now, I'm just gonna take off the little makeup that I still have on and just go to bed. Oh my freaking gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Ah! And you know what's gonna happen next, right? I'm so t so freaking tired. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel and you want to see all the Curacao adventures and travel along, click that subscribe button and then I will see you next time. Bye!